too many cars. Just want to tell you what I'm doing here. Um, this is my pride and joy. I want to keep this one. I want to finish this one off exactly the way I want it. So, unfortunately, I might have to sell my Pontiac. Sorry, but. I can only do so many cars to the standard that I want to do them. Um, probably only one. My patrol, I love my patrol. So I can't get rid of that. That there, my workhorse. So I don't want to get rid of that. That's not worth a pinch of shit, so there's no point in getting rid of that. So gonna have to be the patrol uh, Pontiac because this I want to have it pristine and I'm getting wet and my patrol's got no roof on it and the Pontiac's in bare metal in the rear quarter so I'm gonna be quick um, so it's got a bit of rust coming out so I've got to fix that that's the first thing that's got to be done it's going to be left exactly how it is, except for that stripe. That stripe's going. That stripe's going. Wheels are staying. Black bars and stainless is staying. Interior is going to be the same, except for cleaner and no ugly cloth insert. Now. I love my triples, they sound great, but they can be a pain in the ass sometimes. So I am collecting bits to go individual throttle bodies. So it's um, gonna be more reliable and still sound great. Okay, so that's the main reason that's gotta go, because that's the only way I'm gonna afford to do ITVs. Uh, the motor needs a freshen up too. This car is basically off the road now, so project has unofficially started because it has a, a blown head gasket. Well, it's not blown as much as it's weeping coolant from the back end of the block between the head and the block. So it's not far off of being blown, so that's why I'm not driving it anymore. Right, so that's the major plans for that. Patrol's gonna be a rolling restoration. That's just fun to drive that thing, so yeah. Um, that piece of crap up there, that's gonna be my experimentation. I'm just gonna go to town on that because I don't have to worry about having it off the road because it's off the road already. Um, yeah, so this is just gonna be a nice little resto mod. Um, semi race theme so it'll get a little bit of track time just a little bit not much but just to have a little bit of fun here and there there's no point having it if you can't use it but yeah it's a nice car I love this car it's my pride and joy isn't it pretty So before I put this thing away for the last time before I um, tear it apart, um, I'll let you know um, I'll be doing as much of the work on this car myself as I can. That's including um, all the interior trim, um, engine work, everything. Um, I'll be uh, having to get some of the machine work done. Um, hopefully I can get Chris Slater at Harman Race Engines to help me out there. I'll be hitting him up when I have more cash. Um, but yeah, the uh, interior, I've got a spare set of seats I'm going to try and um, re-trim. Um, if I stuff them up, it doesn't matter, because I've still got the originals. Um, but if not, they'll go in the car. Um, it's the only way you can learn is to throw yourself in deep, and I'm going to throw myself in deep on that one. Um, I've always wanted to learn how to do interior trim, so one way to learn. 
I will be taking you all along for the ride. I'll be documenting as much as, of it as I can with my fails and triumphs. So come for a ride. Oh, and um, I also write and compose all my own music for my videos. So you can have a good laugh at that. Or maybe a cry, I don't know. So yeah, it's good fun. If you could uh, just subscribe to my videos, that would be a great help. Um, support the channel. Uh, like and share and all that crazy stuff and I'll see you round like a wristle. <laughs>